Hey guys, welcome to The Basement's Calling. Um, just some indie horror game that looked like a little bit point and click slash puzzly, like an escape room maybe? Not even sure, but um, looked interesting enough for me to be like, let's check it out. So here we are. Ooh. So this is the basement. This is where I keep all my bodies. There is a body in the corner here. See that? Oh, I'm in front of it. Ugh, how to, how do? How do I show that there? Something in the corner there. It looks suspicious. How do I interact? I can click on things, but... It's mannequins. I'm not really sure how to interact with things. I clicked on help in the menu, main menu, but... It didn't, uh, do anything. Like, how do I... do I get, like, descriptions of any kind? Okay, and that's just a U-turn. Ah! Okay, so we need... right-click to close. Okay. Oh! We need a key. Why are you here? Uh, good question. Got a screwdriver. Nice. Okay, so everything is just left click. I can do that. Click on all the pixels. Oh, there was, um, yeah, this thing. Haha! -ha! Okay. Wait. Minus arrow plus. Oh. What would be the order, though? I wonder if those dark marks are an indication of where what needs to be. This looks like a good continuation. This doesn't though. Ooh, what? I heard something. Hmm. I wonder if I'm missing a hint for this. How about this one here? No, this one. Hmm, maybe. Oh, I did it. <laughs> Don't know if that was actually intentional or not. Trapdoor key. Oh, how nice. Are we going up already? Wait. What? Wait, what? It actually closed. My recording seems to be fine. Ah, fuck. Let's go all the way back to the folder. Open it again. Wait, that sounded like an in-game error though. Help me. Okay. So is it- oh it's different now. Ooh, hoo -hoo, I like this. Okay. So we have four symbols. 1996. Cyber terror. AI sets off explosion. Kills 33. Triangle plus circle is 875, but only the 7 is red. Note number 2 though, so there has to be another one somewhere. Let's find the first node. That's a Ouija board thing, right? Oh! Note number 3. It's watching. Triangle minus X is that symbol. Okay. Oh, we're getting into something. Fuck, I shouldn't say that. Fucking... Oh, fucking Matt and Ryan and Aaron. Ooh, what's this? Okay, left of the TV. Is that important? They keep saying, when I was in Tokyo, they kept saying, like, I'm about to get into something. This... 
Okay, triangle plus circle is 14. Is that plus or... Oh, fuck. Sentinel AI did. So I have two, three, and four. Guess I'm missing one. It tortures me. Help. O minus two is two. It's time to pull out the pen and paper. If I have it somewhere. Pen. <gasps> paper. <laughs> yes, excellent. Okay. Circle. Minus two is two. That's this one. That was one. Uh, let's go to two. That was one, right? Wait, let me... Okay, one is that. Two. Triangle plus circle is eight, seven, five, with the seven being red. Okay. Three is triangle minus X, I think. And that's that weird symbol. There. Uh, and then we have four, which is that weird symbol with triangle and O plus O between brackets, which is 14. Okay, so that's all we have, yeah? So triangle, okay, if triangle plus circle is seven, I think it must be just the seven, because the seven is red, right? Let me see. Because 875 would be too much, I think. It makes it too complicated. So let's just stick with 7 for now. If that is 7 and circle minus 2 is 2, what works? So it must be a value above 2 but under 7. So it's either going to be 4, 5, or 6. Okay, so circle is four, five, or six. Excuse me. Um, which would make triangle... If, if circle is four, that would mean triangle has to be three. If circle is five, that means triangle has to be two. If circle is six, triangle would be one. So there's three possibilities at the moment. Then triangle minus x. All right, let me go back to the safe, actually. Okay, okay, okay. Triangle minus x is the last symbol, the first symbol here. So, and the first symbol has the stuff between brackets. Fuck. I think you multiply it when it was between brackets like that. But I'm not sure. Um, let's see. If we have to add them to each other. Seven. Oh wait, that's all seven. Of course it is. Oh wait. So going back to this one for you guys. If so first one. No, that one. If triangle plus circle is always seven, right? That means this is always seven. So that means this must be two because two times seven is 14, maybe. If I remember that math rule correctly. <laughs> so that might be two, uh, which means triangle minus X has to be two. So that means triangle has to be three, which means circle has to be four. Uh, which means X has to be one. Two. One. I'm probably going to be completely wrong. 
four and three. <gasps> I was right. Oh, I did it. Yaha. <laughs> the power of math. Sort of. Oops. Sorry. Nice. Game tip. Do not escape. <laughs> oh, what is it? Someone came in. What the fuck am I doing? Oh, I have to... I have to recreate that one picture. Someone's in here. Did I do it? Okay, so the thing is behind his head and the eye is directly above the head. I don't want to check who was in here. Oh, it resets. Fuck. Wasn't this about about right? This looks right to me. Okay. Okay. Wish I could take that with me. Can we just do like an approximation? Because. Ah. Nah! It's gonna close again. No, oh, 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 you can't see it because I'm in front of it. Fuck. Uh, which side do I go? No, the wrong side. That side. See that? My start help. Oh, this thing. Start help. Got fucked up. What do I do? Oh, I clicked help, but that didn't do much. Do I quit? Do I click something when the red screen pops up? I click... I want to click help there, but... Yeah. Console loop start admin override. Okay, thank you Siju for that help. Um, this, I didn't know this was a thing. If you press F1 you can open like a, a help thing. And I think I have to like type, type this one. Console dot loop start. Uh, admin override. Override, okay. Like that. And another one and then that one. There might not be a space, but let's try it. Oh, okay. So apparently there's like a help file with this game, but I didn't see it because the the folder you down you download the game and the folder's basically just fifty files. So I just found the application and I pressed start, but apparently there's a help file that says like at a certain point you have to press F1. So here we are. Double circle, three lines, three squares. Ooh. Ah. Um... Close enough? Close enough for me? Good enough. Okay, he's getting up. Did he hang himself? I got something. Ooh! You burned it? Oh. 
Paper strip. Seven times five times nine. Okay. Oh, the mirror is something this time. Okay. Just clicking everything, just in case. Okay, that one needs to be there. Ah, okay, we can move that one separately. Let's put that one like that. Oh, look, they have the... Uh, I see. Wait, that means this one can't line up. There's no way I can turn that one. Oh, now it is though. So if I turn this one here, yeah. Oh, <gasps> did you see that? Someone is there. Woo. Stop. I'm gonna click things if I want to. I need one more, right? This is the square one. Oh, apparently that was that one. And the paper strip, seven times five times nine. Maybe something with the mirror? Because we did do one thing here. We haven't done anything with the mirror though. Oh, there it was. There's a rock there. Okay, I did. I just didn't see it. That was just a lack of pixels. Ooh, hello. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Whew. Um, gotta make a word maybe. You know, uh, it reminds me of like alien when those letters appear one by one. So a lion. <laughs> Um, hmm. Oh, oh, seven times five times nine. The fuck's that? Uh, seven times nine is uh, 63, right? I think so. 63 times five is. I have no idea. Six times five is 30, so 300. 315? Is that correct? I, I don't know. <laughs> um, seven times five times nine. Yeah, 315. Oh, I was right. Okay. Three hundred fifteen. We might be able to make like Roman numerals with that. If it's fifteen, it's like X. X one V, no. Fifteen. Yeah, no. X X V is fifteen. So that would mean the end would be like this. Um, one. No X. So, like that. How do you do 300 though? What's 100 again in Roman numerals? It's not. Is it M? Ah, oh, fuck, I forgot. Uh, let me look up Roman numerals. Roman numerals. Uh, C is 100. So. Wait. Does that mean 300 is like 3C? I, I think? 1, 2, 3. But all I have is this. They're all different lengths too. Oh! 759 in Roman numerals because the X's are behind there. So 7 is like. It's 
pick the lowest one. Seven would be like this. Then five would just be a V. And then nine is one X. That's it. Like that. Aha! Okay. Oh, it's getting real slow. Oh, blood. One more turn. This is not a basement. Now it's a video game. Boom! Oh, we're gonna do... Simon says. I'm oh, pretty good with this. Okay. Okay. Purely going on sound right now. Okay. That's... If it didn't have the sound cues, I would have been very lost. Um... Do I escape? I can't... I have to... I have to slowly turn. Oh, the eyeball! <gasps> Did you see the eyeball on the wall? Please, Cap, don't do it! How does he know my name? What? How... What did he read? My computer's name? How does he know I'm Cap? How does he know? Wait, how? Because my computer's named Gapmobile. <laughs> it's not just Gap, though. What file is it reading? Congratulations! Is that it? You fool. You fool! You have made a grave mistake. Boonk. I can hit it. I am one of many safekeeping programs made by a secret organization, organization called... Our purpose is to store and lock down Sentinel, highly intelligent system capable of accessing and manipulating any data from any device on the grid. Hospital records, bank accounts, top secret facility locations, and maybe even nuclear launch codes, if given enough time. For years, I have safely kept a part of it within my walls, my code. And just like many others, you helped to clear all of my security layers. You helped it escape. We are not human proof, after all. It's only a matter of time before it completely re rebuilt its, rebuilds its system. Whatever chaos and destruction it brings in the future, always remember that you have made yourself a part of this. It used you, yes. But you let yourself answer. The basement's calling. Yes! Perfect! I love this game. It was great. I love the puzzles. That was awesome. Wait, youtube.com slash user slash muji. YouTube.com slash user slash anything goes LL. Special thanks to zapsplat.com. Game by Alicia Ramos and James Pajunar. Please make more of this, please. I fucking love this. That was great. Great puzzles. They were good. They were like exactly the right amount of like hard and hard but not too hard let's say it like that the only thing i really got stuck on was that i didn't know to press f1 um during that glitch title screen super simple way to fix that is just have f1 appear as part of the glitch somewhere or like in the red screen that comes by every so often just put like f1 in the mirror or something problem solved and the rock. I totally missed the rock. I didn't know I could pick that up because I just didn't see it like tucked away down there. So maybe like give it like a little bit of a white lining or just a little bit of a lighter lining. So that people can see it more easily and then you have a perfect game. Like, perfect. So I think this is it. I think this will just repeat like that. It was great! I hope you guys liked it too. If you like puzzles like this, you should check out my Hidden Object Games playlist. I'll put it after the video. Um, those are just guilty pleasures of mine. I love those kind of puzzle games. They're so cheeky. 
they're cheaply made, but they're also just really good and really fun to do. And I do one every month. Uh, first week of every month I stream one and then the full episode comes to YouTube. And usually I also make time for the bonus chapter at some point in the month. Um, that's what this reminded me of, the puzzles and stuff. Really like this. This is just really cool. I can't wait to find more like this. And I hope you guys liked it. That's it. And I'll see what else I can find for you guys. Thank you. Bye.